there are a number of costs included in this contract. Uh, those include um, certain raises of something in the neighborhood of 6.5% annually over the next two years uh, for every employee covered, all for an incremental cost. This does not include the salaries that people are already receiving and the longevity bonuses they're already receiving um, for a total incremental cost under the contract of $1.5 million in fiscal 2020 and $3 million in fiscal 21. So for me, this is an issue of fairness. I would like for every single person in the state of Connecticut to get these terms, everybody. It would be wonderful. But the fact of the matter is they don't. And what has happened, it's not just that some people are getting it and some people aren't. That's life, hey, that's fair. But in this case, some people are getting it and the people who are not are paying for it. And to me, that's about the biggest, broadest issue of fairness among all those that we hear about in this General Assembly. That is the one that rings home the most. And because of that, I will not be supporting this resolution. Thank you, Mr. Speaker.